Hello everyone and welcome back to the channel and welcome back to some more Medieval Dynasty where today we, we have a deer in our sheds. I wonder if I can punch it to death. Ah, oh, no, I couldn't. Fine, no, today we have to make some money, unfortunately. We have to make a lot of money and then give it all away to the king, basically, or the thieving Castellan. Uh, either way, we can't not do it, so we have to do it, and as such, I am thinking, how is the best way to make money? I am thinking, we have a bunch of copper, no, we don't have a copper, um, clay, clay is what I was thinking, we have 296 clay, you know what, what we're going to do is, we're going to go to management, go to crafting, Workshop. Uh, clay bowl is going to come off the list of things to do. And wood bowl is going to go back on. Because we're going to need some of those, I would say. Well, the current, actually, I don't know. Because the clay bowls don't appear on the used section. So it's wooden bowls, wooden plates, wooden plates wooden bowl, sorry, clay bowls. I'm thinking that clay bowls, I know, well, clay bowls aren't on the list of ingredients for certain foods, for any of the foods. So clay items are not on those lists. It's only the wooden stuff. Kind of hoping that gets added later on, because otherwise the clay bowls are kind of pointless, other than to sell. So, what I'm thinking is, we use the clay for now, Ah, we can't carry that much. Yeah. Use the clay now to make some money. Okay, we can take a bit more than that. There's the clay. So I'm thinking 27 more. Actually, how much is it for a clay bowl? Let's take a look. So crafting, tavern, it's not going to be there. It's going to be in the workshop. Clay bowl is two clay. So as long as I have an even number, that's fine. So if I take one, I'll take three more. Yeah, it's about as much as we can carry, so that's cool. I think we'd only be taking one more other than that. So yes, if we make this, let's see how much they sell for. They sell, their value is 20 gold. After this, we're gonna make a bunch of foods and uh, I need this pottery wheel. Sorry, dude. Yeah, just you know, bugger off. Go do something else. So yeah, make the clay bowls. Then we're gonna make some food. And after that, let's see what we've got. I should be able to get some potage. And there's also all the hundreds of tons of mushroom soup that we've got. Well, it's not really hundreds of tons, but it's some mushroom soup that we can use. And as such, we can use that to make money. We only need to make around 1,200 gold. So it's not going to be too impossible. It's just I want to get all of it together and then take it all in one go, where possible with weight being the exceptional thing that we can't control. Ah, right. Other than that, I shall see you in a minute, and we shall take a look at what food items we can, can't take with us. Okay, so looking at the mushroom soups, we have plenty of them. And let's see how much we can probably take all, most of anyway. Yeah, at least four, but I think we're all right on mushroom soups. Um, so we'll add those, that to the list of stuff we can sell. Um, got some eggs coming in. We haven't got much fish meat at all anymore because that's all gone rotten. But that's fine because that's allowed us to have tons of other stuff. Um, fertilizer. Try to see 
salt. We could probably get away with selling the salt. And I think there's some salt over here. We can't even do it now because it's night time and everyone's going to, going to have gone to bed, sadly. But we can at least get everything set up for the morning. Yep, there is 96 salt there. That's way too much for us to carry. Fine. So, 65. And then if I go see how much weight this costs us, we'll know how much to take. 25. We're a little bit over. That is fine. So... What I can do is I can drop a little bit of salt and we are good to go. In the morning, that is. I will drop it off all off for the moment. Um, shall I just take... Ah, whoops. Wrong key. Sit. No, I can't. Oh, wait. That's too... That was too few. I wanted to do that. There we go. 60 salt is perfect. So I'll put it all back in here, because nothing goes in here. And then we'll take that in the morning to the well to the traders, because not one trader is going to be able to take all this, unfortunately. Oops. And done. So that is 63 tons of food. Uh, hello. I wonder, can I punch you to death? Stop. Ah, oh, you clever. So I need to fence this off better, apparently. Yeah. So my farmer isn't gonna, is not going to need help, unfortunately. So I'm going to have to sort that out. And we're going to do that now, I would say. We're going to take a couple of broken iron hose, that, and a bag. Actually, we're going to do the... Fertilizer first. Let's take 64 and see where we end up. I think all of this actually just requires the hoe. Cool. So let's equip a hoe and start hoeing. So has she need to seed? So she started. So she's obviously, she's fertilized all of this field, which is good. That's a good start. I can't remember what seeds I'm needing here. So I'm just going to get up to the seeding stage and then we're going to leave the rest for, what's her face? Her minor. No. Gerarda? Gerarda. That's her name. If it's not, it is now. She's changed her name. But yeah, she's not going to get both these fields finished by the end of spring if I don't help her. She's going to get close, but I kind of want to make sure that she gets it all done so she can get a little bit of the barn work done. At least that way, she we, we keep on top of getting more fertilizer in because we're getting a ton of it through rotten food and the cows. Will you p go away? He is stalking my field. Hmm. Do I take him out? I do need some hunting skills, admittedly. But I probably... That just can't be asked, basically. Hunting is one thing that I... Well, hunting and fishing is the things I can't have, or don't have patience for. Everything else I can see an immediate action with. Hunting, I have to chase the animals down. Oh, that hoe broke, but that's fine. I picked up other ones. So maybe I should look at getting better arrows so I can one-shot things better. Hmm. That could be where we go. And then, obviously, the better equipment means that our people are getting better. That requires seed. That's carrots already growing. Uh, that requires fertilizer. Well, we have a f some fertilizer, so let's get that done. And yeah, this is all we're going to be doing through the night while we wait for daytime to be able to sell. Uh, fertilizer. I don't know if 64 is going to be enough, but it'll have to do. 
And yeah, farming is going to be something that we actually get a tremendous amount of over the next few seasons. And therefore, hopefully, we get up to the stable. Oh, that would be amazing. Because one, one, we can get the donkeys. Two, we can get a horse. And then we need to make a bunch more money to be able to do all of that, buy those. But I think with two fields and the potential of getting our parents back, our mother mother's group back, we should be in a good position by that point because some of those will be able to work on the fields. One of those will be working with the stable and then we'll have blacksmiths back. Actually, we're only getting three back, so... In time, we'll get all of that. We're going to have to look at getting more people around, aren't we? Oh dear. No, that's not needed fertilizer. You know what? I need some drink and I need some water, so I'm going to go get some of that. And I shall see you in the morning when we're about to sell everything and then get rid of all the money. Okay, so welcome back. Good morning, everyone. And yes, as you can tell, I was thrashing away all night. And that um, begs the question, does my wife think I'm cheating on me? Because I haven't been home all night. And I'm... this guy is really starting to bug me out. He he's like he wants to be killed. But yes, I've not been at home. And my wife probably thinks I've been cheating on her. Um, I've been helping out the farmer all night so that the farmer has more free time on her hands. To do what with that free time in the medieval ages? There is only one thing to do, and that is go to the pub. Yeah, so I'm helping her get to the pub, and my wife is stuck at home with our kid. Also, it's raining, and I'm going to go kill this deer because it, it's just annoying the hell out of me, mooing all night long whilst I was thrashing away, not with the farmer's wife. Or the farmer. The farmer, don't think the farmer is actually... No, she's not married yet. Uh, right, longbow. And probably only need five of those. Right, let's get this done. Oh yeah, sorry. Hello wife. Um, yeah, I've been chasing down this horrible deer all night. Um, I'm going to go kill it now. Because I only just remembered I have a bow to kill it with. I don't think she's believing my story. Um, I've not been thrashing away in the barn with the hay and the farmer girl. Um, yeah, none of that is happening. I'm not being very convincing, am I? Oh, what am I doing? F on that, one on that, hitting all the wrong keys, and in the face. Yeah, don't anyone else come around. I need a knife to skin it. Yeah, can kill it all day long, but I need a knife. They're down to just six knives. Are you kidding me? They're going through their stone knives like crazy. I think I need to make some better knives. I think we're going to be needing to make some iron knives, people. Yeah, that's going to be the next thing on our list of things to do. So let's put that away for the people. Meat doesn't go in there, does it? So we've got the straw. That can go in here. Let's pick up the meats. How much uh, straw have we got? A thousand. It's worth 0.1 each. So that is 10. <laughs> 10 gold, and that's it. Uh, we have quite a lot of wooden bowls now. So we're getting there on that. Actually, I need to take those with me to sell. The wooden ladles, they can stay. The rye grain can be used for cooking in the tavern, creating flour of the kern in the barn, or sowing in the fields. Okay. Isn't rye grain also used for... No. Hen house. Rye grain and oat grain. So how much oat grain have we got now? Um, oat grain, only 38. Isn't that being planted now? Management fields. Um, oat grain, none. Yeah, we need to get some more of that at some points. 
or some, well, or just plant some at some points. But either way, I'm probably going to need some more because I'll probably plant all of that so we get a massive income afterwards. But yes, I've planted all the fields. Or sorry, not planted all the fields. I've ploughed all the fields ready for seeding so the farmer can seed them all she wants. Um, I'm going to drop this stuff off. Actually, that's why I'm going over here. Meat. I have three meats for our people to cook with. And yet yeah, clay bowls. Uh, I won't pick everything pick up everything just yet. Let's put the stuff away. So that I can take it all in one go. And there's that, there's that. And what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna put the fur boots away and take my shoes because they weigh less. And I want a little bit more inventory capacity. Just because I think those 10 bowls are actually going to be a little bit too much for me otherwise. Hoping not, but you never know. So... Can I transfer... How do I transfer all? I don't think there is a way to transfer all. Ah, stupid keys. There we go. There we go. Ah, oh, we're point five over. Hmm. So. Damn. I could just eat one of the mushrooms. Yeah. I'm gonna I'm gonna need to eat more than one mushroom thingy. Never mind. Right. Let me I'm gonna put that away. And I'm gonna put that away. So I just need to eat two now. Look at that. And I know we're three kilos over. Okay, I'm guessing I'm putting some... I'll put some salt away. The bowls I will sell because I don't need them right now. Ah, yes, it's fine. <sighs> I need to look at making a bigger backpack because that's the next thing. Lots more backpack space and just inventory space in general. So, six. How much do they weigh each? It doesn't set. Point five. There we go. So, get some water, and we're going to head off. They're having a conversation. Good for them. I'm going to earn the town some money so we can stay in business as a town and become amazeballs. And become the best town in the valley. And the richest town in the valley at some point, hopefully. Okay, so here we are. And we're going to go straight in the tavern because that's the quickest place to find. Oh no, she's not here. I think she's just coming back. Yeah, this is, yeah, whatever her name is. I can't pronounce it. But yeah, let's sell all the food to her because that's easily done. Sadly, they don't stack up when in here. It's because they sell for a different price each time. Which is weird. Yeah, price 10.7 each. And then that one's 11 each. Why are they so different? 12.1, yeah, 12.6. And there's nothing condition-wise different about them. The weight is the same. Interesting. And then we see if we can sell all the salt to her. Near enough. And we're about there on the money. Uh, we've got some wooden bowls. No, that's 
fine. That's the food that we had, yeah. So we'll take that back with us. And then the clay bar will sell for 14 each. So that's 800 and something, which she does have. Almost. There's 10, <laughs> 10 left. So those extra 10 that I picked up, she couldn't actually buy. But talk to Unigast. Uh, here you go. That should cover everything. And then we want to talk to him again. Um, oh, why? I can't buy anything from him any anymore. Oh. Well, that's weird. Let's go find another shopkeeper. I know there's one over here. Over by the cows. Which we will get eventually. What do we need for a cow, actually? So, stable is next. Fold is for sheep. Cow shed, obviously. Which is 3,500. Hmm. Well... We're a long way off getting a cow. Uh, yeah, buy my clay bowls off me for the same price as the other place, which is good. Uh, we're very poor on money, but at least we have some money. Yeah. Do I buy a goose? 650, I can't afford one. Plus, I'd need someone to look after it, wouldn't I? So there's no points. It will get me more eggs, though. And what next? There's a couple of quests in my own village, but I don't really care about that. I think the next thing we need to work on is better knives. So we need to go mining for stuff like that. And we need to get the mine. Yeah, we need to get the mine, and that's going to take us an absolute age to get that done. Uh, palisade fence, log fence, wooden fence, stick fence, simple stick fence. No, I probably want to go for the stone one, if I'm honest, if and when we ever get that. I mean, I'd love the wooden bench schematic, but it's 1500s, and the stalls to go with it. Actually, you know, why is there no like picnic table kind of thing? Yeah. So, like these. Where are these? A uh, wooden table, maybe? Is there a crafting table? Um, Smithy is not under that. It's not a tavern workshop. No, Smithy again. No. That's something, isn't it? And Tavern again, Workshop. No, then Smithy again. No. Interesting. I mean, I can make iron knives. They require two iron bars. So I need to go, go do some mining. But otherwise, actually, is there any management stuff that we need to do? Because it's been a day. Let's see if anything has run out. Doesn't look like it has there. Uh, yeah, you've got... Oh, no mushrooms. Parasol mushrooms. Okay, so what we're going to do is... Stop that for the moment. And... Potage... With salted meat, no. That's with salted meat. Porridge, oat grain in a bowl. Which one did we use? Rye grain, which is gruel. No resources, no rye grain. No, because we've... We do have rye grain. No, we don't have rye grain, do we? Meat to gravy. We need onions. We don't have any onions. Scrambled egg. We have some eggs. But aren't we making something else with eggs? No. Scrambled eggs with mushrooms. 
Vegetable soup, we don't have any beetroot, porridge with apple, no, flatbread, buckets of water. Yeah, and this is where we get into the stuff that we're well away from being able to manage. So maybe we just put 50% on each of those. Yeah, that'll do for the moment. Until we get some more mushrooms in to make mushroom soup. Cool, so Smithy has no worker. Stores and anything have anything. I don't think you need anything. No, so that's fine. The pig side doesn't. You, how are you doing? Yeah, yeah, you don't actually need it. You're not in there just yet, but you are working. That's fine. And then hunters. Yeah, you're working. Don't have anyone in the fishing hut just yet. Excavation. Uh, you need another axe. Really? I'm guessing you're out of axe as well. No, you've got axe as well. Fine. And here. Shovel is what is needed. And you have a shovel. Cool. So we need to go home and make an axe. I think I'll make... Um, a knife and a iron axe, an iron, uh, iron knife and iron axe, and then next time round we're gonna have to go get a bunch of iron, I would say, so that we can make a bunch of iron knives and axes, and probably pickaxes as well. And then as, when we get the mine up and running, if we ever get it up and running, we're gonna have to get a load of each of the resources so that. We can build a stockpile of each of the resources and just make a bunch of each of them. So it's easier to manage our workers and just have more of them ever needed. That is the plan. We'll see whether that actually works. I need to get a way of getting iron back down here a lot quicker. And I'm thinking I might make another store store all the way up the top by the mines because then I will have the ability to put everything in there and it will appear down here basically I think that's how it works pretty sure that's how it works because obviously that's yeah that's how it works because so when we did the food stores it works like that pretty sure it work the same with the general stores these Deer everywhere. Did you just come in there? No, you didn't. But hey, that'll be next time round. And for now, I'm going to say hello to my good friend Gerarda. How are you doing? How is the seeding coming along? In fact, you're doing pretty well. Have you finished down? Oh, you haven't finished this field. Or have I selected anything for this field? Um, no, it's still on rye. So, what have I got here? Ah, it's going to be very tricky for me to figure this out. Carrots, pretty sure that's beetroots and onion. Well, let's go into it. So... Beetroot, onion, how many are there? Um, 33, we might have more than that. Cabbage might be something that we put in, and we don't have any poppy seeds. I think we also want some oat as well. We might end up needing a third field before too long. So, oats. Flax and cabbage. Onion seed is what she's planting. Wheat. Is that this one? Yeah, wheat is already in there. That's fine. So, uh, flax, oats, and cabbage is what we need. No. Actually, do we? Because. We've got 
48 flax already, so that should be okay. Onion, there's a few more onion seeds, so I think that'll be fine for the moment. We haven't got any cabbage and definitely want some oats. So cabbage and oats, I believe. Cabbage and oats, yes. So we go into that field. And cabbage. In actual fact, we probably only want two cabbage because we've still got a thousand left over. And then oats on the remaining. Awesome. Yeah. Except it's getting there. Our fields are getting there. She just needs to speed up. In actual fact, she's gone from being tier garbage. I can't remember if she was tier one or tier two. But she was definitely low tier in farming. And now she's tier three already. So that's pretty good. Uh, yep, tier three. And she's tier three with diplomacy as well. And this guy is going to be an excavation dude. Tibold. In fact, I can start planning out what each of them are going to be. You're going to be whatever's needed. Probably a farmer. You're going to be, you could be a fishy person. And again, you are all around just average. Godfred. And then my child, the super child that is, is... Gonna be a crafter, I would say, because it's tier six. So yeah. But anyway, that is it for this video. We've got another deer invading our paddocks or our fields. Hopefully not stealing all the seeds and eating them. Um, but hopefully next time round we get up to the mine and we can build ourselves a stores, and therefore we can get a bunch of mining done. And in the in that. Oh, with that, we will be able to make a bunch of iron tools just throughout the seasons and go up there a bit more often because we can actually make a bit of progress up there. But anyway, that's going to do it for this video. So I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, remember to hit that like button, put a comment in the field below, and subscribe. And I'll see you next time. So have fun and enjoy the rest of your day. They're feeling suicidal, aren't they, these deer?